<laughs> Welcome to the 31 Nights of Magoween! Every day in the month of October, I will review one spooky, scary movie! Come and join if you dare! Ah, <laughs> oh, shit! Here we go again. So you may be wondering why I'm covering the second Quiet Place film instead of the first one. Want to answer that question? I don't know. I made the lineup for the films I would be covering and it just happened. Anyways, The Quiet Place Part 2 is a good film. I will go as far as saying that Part 2 took everything that made the first film good and expanded upon it to make a film that seems more open and bigger than the first movie. The strongest aspects of the film, I'd say, are the horror and the characters. The horror in A Quiet Place 2 expands on the already winning formula that was established in the first film. And with a more expansive setting instead of a tight area with the house being the central focal point, it had, them, it had them be more creative with the way the horror was presented. The characters in this film are good too. I enjoyed the family dynamic in the first film and being able to see them continue to grow and lean on each other more after the events of the first film is so good to see with a lot of progression and everything. Uh, even Killian Murphy's character of Emmett was intriguing to watch. From his first time on screen, you think he would be cold and uncaring, but by the end of the film, you can understand and sympathize with him. And he goes through an arc in this film, and it's satisfying to see the character growth throughout the movie. I guess I could say the only negative aspect of this film is that I would have with it would be the story. The story isn't that rock solid. There were times when it wants to present these larger questions or expand the lore the lore in the universe, but often in the film they don't fully commit on exploring these ideas and leave them open-ended or not even fully realized. Just felt like a lot of wasted opportunities to expand the story more, but maybe that's when the sequel or prequels will do. A Quiet Place Part 2 was released on May 28th, 2021 at a budget ranging from 55 to 61 million dollars. After its run at the box office, it would go on to gross 297.4 million dollars. Overall, Quiet Place Part 2 is a good sequel. It does a good job expanding the universe of the first movie. It sets up perfectly for the cinematic world they are trying to create. I'm going to give A Quiet Place Part 2 an 8.5 out of 10. Stay tuned for Night 9.